Hello YouTube, this is Chris Gilbert, Bank Rental Services. Today's video is going to be on a very uh, well-known Mandela effect. Uh, it has to do with Star Wars. And it's the very famous line that's all over shirts and hats and any kind of memorabilia you can think of. It's been in movies and TV shows and skits and so on and so on. And you probably already know what it is if you're familiar with the Mandela effect and have researched this at all. It's where... Darth Vader says to Luke Skywalker, Luke, I am your father. And right after the big fight scene, and he gets his hand cut off, and he's telling uh, Luke that he's his father. It's always been just straight up, Luke, I am your father. There's no no, Luke, I am your father. There's no no, I am your father. It's just Luke, I am your father. So before I get onto the video, and let me point out, I've got a bunch of videos up here and different things. I'm going to try something right now and not mention what these are for. I'm only going to be showing from here over. I'm not going to be showing from here over here. They're for part two. I've already mentioned what the part two is. Just haven't got around to make it yet. I want to see if it's uh, YouTube's algorithm that's uh, taking my subs and not pushing my videos because I speak on specific topics, um, which I believe that's what it is. Or if people are unsubscribing from me and so on and so on and I want to touch on something real quick before we get on to the video so please be patient with me yes I complain about YouTube taking my subs and uh, and stuff of that nature but I keep getting comments by especially from certain people and I mean no hate to you you know who you are um, please stop telling me to go back to the graveyard and do a paranormal investigations and ghost hunts and stuff like that I've made it very clear in other videos that I no longer um, paranormal investigate the way I used to. I still do paranormal investigations, but it's biblical. I don't do them the way I used to. I don't believe that what I'm speaking to is what um, I once did believe from things like ghost hunters, you know, taps and stuff like that, TVs, movie shows, whatever. I always thought they were, you know, passed on loved ones that could speak to you and so on and so on. Uh, and sometimes demonic things or evil spirits, but I always thought that you could talk to um, your past loved ones that were saved and the Bible doesn't teach that it actually teaches the complete opposite And I believe unless YouTube's taking it down or something. I have that video up somewhere on my channel If not if you can't find it, let me know and um, I will remake it again Because that's very important, but please stop pushing that It's not always about the subs never has been about the subs. Yes. Do I want to grow big and have a uh, a big channel and a lot of views and subscribers and YouTube pay me and stuff and, and pay me well. Uh, yes, I do. For Anybody does. But it's not about that. I will never sell out. I will never sell my soul. If that pisses off YouTube or people um, really actually do unsubscribe me and they talk crap or whatever, then that just comes with the territory. I've said it before and I say it again. Jesus... God's son said the world hated him and that they would hate us because of him. The world would hate us because of him. Because he's God's son in what he taught and he went against the masses. He went against the false prophets. He went against the liars. He went against the people that refused to see the truth of what God was telling him to say. And so if that's the case, and that's what's going on. I wear that badge of on with honor. With that being said, let's go ahead and get on to this video. So, I've always been a huge Star Wars fan. My wife's always been a real, real huge Star Wars fan. Before they got all woke and um, Lucasfilm sold out to Disney. And Disney got even more... Uh, I can't say they got more woke. They show their wokeness more than what they used to. Uh, they show more now that they're part of the Illuminati than what they used to. So, I, and like many others, know that it was always, Luke, I am your father. Like I said at the beginning of the video. I made a video about four years ago, give or take a little bit, because it's never exactly pinpoint when it says four years or two years or whatever on the bottom of your videos. But it was roughly about four, four years ago. Then I made this video here, uh, the, and I'll link it in the description box below. Go watch it. It's technically the part one of this because I mentioned this in that video. 
And before I made that video, I had searched upside down, right side, left side, anywhere you can look, YouTube, Google it, whatever, because I had heard from the all times YouTube channel that I shouted out not long ago that that had been changed. And I started seeing other people talk about that it had been changed to from Luke, I am your father to no, I am your father. So I looked into it and looked into it and could not find it anywhere. Everything I was finding was the Mandela effect of no, I am your father. So that's why I put it in that video. So fast forward off and on throughout the four, these four years, I have looked for it. Could not find it anywhere. I brought it up to my wife, showed her um, in 2019, 2020 era. Uh, I, uh, uh, she's the, uh, Mandalorian was getting ready to come out. Well, it says it came out in 2019. We didn't start watching it until 2020. So we decided we were going to binge watch all the Star Wars from the original three that we grew up on all the way up to all the new ones. Some of the new ones I hadn't really seen at that point because I really wasn't interested. They didn't seem like they stayed with the lore of uh, Star Wars. And for everybody was saying they were garbage and junk, and so I just didn't watch them. But I went ahead and watched them around 2020 just to get caught up with everything and 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 make sure that I knew all the little bits and bobs and turns and lore and all that that may be talked about in The Mandalorian so that I knew what was going on. And still didn't see it. And I actually pointed it out to my wife. I said, see, I told you it says... No, I am your father. When we were binge watching uh, the Star Wars movies. And so, last night, uh, I was watching uh, All Times, and he was talking about the Star Wars Mandela effects. And it got brought up again about the No, I am your father. So I went ahead and looked it up, and I found, four years later, some videos that one shows proof that it's always been Luke, I am your father, and not just no, I'm your father. Uh, and I've also got a video that shows both the Mandela effect of no, I'm your father, and Luke, I am your father, mixed. Kind of like I did with the Isaiah, Isaiah 11, 6 to 8, with the lion and the lamb. And, and I proved that it, it always said Lion and the Lamb, but then there was that residue of wolf. And so now it says in that article from 1952, it says the wolf and the lion. So that's the, the not just the residue, but also the Mandela effect change. Well, I've also found that in the Luke, I am your father. And I'm going to prove that one, it used to always say um, Luke, I am your father, but then also show with a simple Google search that they said that that's the improper way. It's never said that it's misremembered and so on. And then I'm also going to show that from James Earl Jones's own mouth, that it's always been Luke. I am your father. He started acting around 22 years old. Um, he's been acting since. Um, 1953, so roughly about 22 years old till present. So, I mean, and then he was the voice of uh, uh, Darth Vader. So you would think that he would know for a 100% fact if it was no, I'm your father, no, Luke, I'm your father, or Luke, I am your father. He would know. If anybody would know, he would know. Being that he made that line so famous, and no one's ever corrected him. Whenever he's in interviews and stuff like that, they don't correct him. And there's also videos which kind of weird. Um, Satan's getting kind of sloppy and messy with the, not just the residue and with um, uh, the Mandela effect being mixed together. But also, like I said, I've been looking all these four years and couldn't find anything. Well, a, a couple of these videos that I'm going to show you today, proof, were from seven years ago. So how did I miss them? I mean, and they were pretty close up in the, the YouTube search when I searched Luke, I am your father. 
So anyway, let's go ahead and get on with this. As you see, this was in 2019 when the Disney suppo it aired on uh, 2019 for the Mandalorian. This is the Google search that I did, Luke, I am your father. And as you see here, very top search says, uh, it is a pivotal plot twist in the movie and usually misquoted uh, in a uh, finged boy, uh, Darth Vader boys, I probably pronounced that wrong, as Luke, I am your father. Whenever, uh, whenever someone named Luke introduces himself uh, to a Star Wars fan, uh, Star Wars, uh, uh, Star Wars persists to maintain the full quote is no, I am your father. Okay. Then if you go down here in 2020, misquote lines, Luke, I am your father. Snopes, which I don't ever agree with and believe with anything they say, but still they say the same thing. Uh, no, Darth Vader didn't actually say Luke, I am your father. Um, claim in Star Wars film Empire Strikes Back Darth Vader says Luke I'm your father uh, false I mean and the list just goes on and on 2022, 2020 I mean it just goes on and on and on and on can anybody explain why the Luke I am your father uh, this is absolutely no version where Vader says Luke I am your father it doesn't exist but I can ass uh, assist Attest to my first-hand experience of hearing it. Um, it goes on and on and on and on. All the way back to at least four years ago when I showed you I made that video. And I touched about this in that video. And I had done, like I said, tons of research even four years ago and could not find it. I have looked for it off and on all this time. And as you see here, it's everybody. News. uh, uh Australian uh, movie image, website, YouTube video, so on and so on. I'll say that, no, Luke, I am your father. Uh, they all say that, um, let me rephrase that. They all say, Luke, I am your father is misquoted. Then you got this video here, again, seven years ago. Listen to what he says. He told me you killed him. No. I. I'm your father. No, I am your father. Okay. This is also seven years ago. This is again James Earl Jones recalls Luke, I am your father. Not no Luke, I am your father, or no, I am your father. He recalls Luke, I am your father. And again, I didn't see this seven years ago. Wasn't there. So it's like the the Mandela effect and the way reality used to be are kind of like sw switching back and forth. And so at one point you can't find anything of the way you remember it. And then all of a sudden you'll find residue and then you'll find it residue mixed with the Mandela effect. But listen, to, listen to what James Earl Jones says. When I first saw the dialogue that said, Luke, I am your father. I said to myself, he's lying. Again, James Earl Jones, been an actor since he was about 22 years old, made that land famous. You think that he would know that it's, no, I am your father, or no, Luke, I am your father. But he always says it, Luke, I am your father. But again, this video seven years ago wasn't there. It would have been there when I made that video that I made about the Mandela effect being real, and it's other devil, but couldn't find it. Or I would have talked about these in that video. Here's another one where uh, James Earl Jones and is is making a joke about what a redneck uh, Jedi would say. And listen to, again to his wording. Okay, Why not? Okay, okay, okay. What what does the redneck Jedi say? No, you ask that because I'm a redneck or because I'm a Jedi. No, because we're both rednecks. But, <laughs> okay, but but well, the redneck Jedi says. Luke, I am your father and your uncle. <laughs> that is pretty funny, but again, <laughs> he didn't say, no, Luke, I am your father. He didn't say, no, I am your father. He said, Luke, I am your father. This is such a famous quote 
But it's on, uh, just like I mentioned in, in the other one that I made about the Mandela effect and talked about this in it four years ago, is it's all over everything. It's shirts, hats, mugs, bedding. I've even seen it on condom wrappers with the picture of Darth Vader on it, and it'll say, Luke, I am your father. No joke. I mean, I've seen it on everything. Not, no, I'm your father. No, Luke, I am your father. But, Luke, I am your father. So, this is the way it used to say, and th from this channel, um, they, I, they apparently they have the VHS of it. Um, and again, well, let me go back here real quick. This was seven years ago. I think I said that. Here's another one from seven years ago. If you notice, it's 777, which in the Bible, the number seven is God's number. So what is, is this God saying, no, you're not going crazy. It's this is the way it's always been. Because if you notice the ones that are showing the way it's always been, it's seven years ago. And where were they seven years ago when I was looking for them? But listen to this. He told me you killed him. Luke, I am your father. Luke, I am your father. And then we have from two years ago. So this is recent, like when, you know, the Mandela effect is slipping, the devil slipping. It's got the residue of the Mandela, the way it was, pre-Mandela effect of Luke, I am your father. But then, like that verse I talked to, that I just brought up again about the lion and the lamb, it also has the no, which is the new way that it's, that everybody remembers. Well, not everybody, but the way it's being said of no. I am your father. So they mix it. It's, it shows the residue of no, or of Luke, I'm your father, but then no Luke, I am your father. So it's got the Mandela effect part in there as well. Sorry, I'm just trying to make this really quick. I'm kind of stumbling over my words. He told me you killed him. Luke, I am your father. Luke. He told me enough. He told me you killed him. Luke, I am your father. No, Luke, I am your father. I played it twice so you could hear it if you didn't hear it the first time. So anyway, there you go, guys. I'm going to go ahead and get up here. I got stuff to do. And again, I apologize if I was kind of stumbling on my words there. Um, just try to get this done really fast and uh, get it up to you guys. And I got other stuff I got to get taken care of before it gets too much later. And it's supposed to be really hot today. So... I just kind of stumble over my words a little bit. And then some of it's kind of a tongue twister. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and leave it there. Use all the links in the About Me section. Rate, comment, subscribe. Much love. God bless. You're not crazy. I'll see you on the next one.